Hi guys, it's Nancy here and I'm back with another process video for you and this one again is using those speciality papers. I've done something a little bit different here. I pulled out my B-side papers from Basic Grey. I have the collection pack and I haven't touched them at all. I also have the 6x6 paper pad and the die cuts. And I was looking and trying to decide what paper to use and I was like, I'm just going to use the bit off the front of the packaging. So I literally just cut it down and actually the packaging that they print on is really kind of decent quality cardstock well it's not cardstock it's like paper but it's thick enough so we literally just cut that down i stuck it on my base so i haven't actually got too much into the collection i used some bits from the 6x6 paper pad but other than that i <laughs> the main bit was that so i do have lots i still have the whole collection of 12x12 left but that's a fab idea if you don't have much stash, even though I do, and yeah, to use that up. So I'm super happy and I love how all the colours work. And they worked quite well with this photo because I had that kind of orange in, as well as the pink, and I had the blue that was on my scarf. So actually it all kind of fixed in quite well. I then cut a strip of that super, super amazing embossed gold. And now I'm just going for the die cut pack from... Uh, mine's gone blank. Pebbles, sprinkling. So I was just looking and thinking maybe about pulling some butterflies or bees out because it's a bit naturey. because I was in the woods. I was at Blair Athol Castle in Scotland. So um, I just kind of went through those. I also had to say the die cuts from this collection. So I'm just going to go through again and pick it out. I really use minimal embellishment on this layout because... Um, I just love that background. <laughs> I love all the papers on the background, so I don't actually want to cover too much up. So this is also going to go opposite another one of my layouts where I'm talking about the hat that I made, the pink hat that I'm wearing. So it's really cool. I'm just going through um, adding some bits and pieces in. Just going through, you know, going through here and seeing what could work. And as I said, I really like just using the little bits and pieces up kind of making quite an eclectic um, mix I really do love that b-side collection I really need to get my button gear and use it because it's so beautiful when it's just sitting there I think because when I brought it loads of people were using it I don't know I sometimes get a little bit funny <laughs> and I'm like no I don't want to follow the norm I don't want to follow the trends and so <laughs> I didn't use it and then it just has sat in my stash which is a bit silly really so as I said this layout was super quick, it took me about 25 minutes, not even that. Um, and yeah, <laughs> just really love how it came together. Um, so just done a really simple photo map um, around pink, black and then pink, just so it helps stand everything out. And then I've got the sticker sheets that came in the collection pack. And I love basic grey sticker sheets. And I just put that frame there just to pull it up a little bit, just so it's not as blocky. And I said just looking at these I was thinking about using that perfect day but the green didn't kind of quite work I don't know I found the greens on the sticker sheet were a different green to the papers um not quite sure but just stuck that vellum piece down and I'm just using lots of little bits of pieces you can see on my phone there I'm actually watching a podcast I didn't realise it was necessarily in there, but I'm actually just watching um, a knitting podcast because it's what I do. I'm kind of, I don't knit at all, but I think that one's yarn junkie. Um, so I was just watching that. So I do apologise that that's really <laughs> distracting in the corner. Um, there's not much left of this video, so I promise <laughs> it won't be too annoying. So I'm just adding a few more little stickers and things on here, just a few little bits and pieces. As I said, I decided to keep my embellishment pretty, yeah, pretty kind of sparse because I didn't want <laughs> too much to show. And then um, I'm then using these again. These came in the collection pack, and that is the I'm trying to think. I completely forgot what I was going to say. Anyway, I apologise. <laughs> But yeah, so I'm just using these tile stickers. Um, I do love basic grey sticker sheets as well. Um, so I'm just going to put my title over the photo here because there was a little bit of dead space in the photo. And also, 
I didn't really know where else to put it, but I actually kind of quite like it there. Um, and I'm just going to journal on the bottom there on that um, cream piece of paper. So that is it. I'm just going to stick the date down and I think Scotland, maybe? <laughs> um, that is it. So this was a super quick layout. I'm sorry the video is a little bit jumpy and things like that. Um, I promise I'll try better. <laughs> but thank you very much everyone for watching and I will be back with some better videos soon, I promise. Thanks very much guys. Bye!